So uh, my friend Megan Betancourt, who is a year older than me, so she graduated last year, um, was a very significant um, Christian influence in my life for um, really as long as I knew her. And we really just spent high school together. Like we were, she was definitely one of my best friends and um, then she moved to Texas, which was dumb. Because, I mean, everybody loved her, you know, no matter what background they were from or anything. She was just really open to talk to anybody she saw. Um, so she was just, you know, lived out her life as a Christian. Um, and actually one time there was, um, I was working on a project for a Christian organization at my school. And I asked her for help. And just, she had so many ideas and scriptures she could cite and, you know, experiences she had. And um, and it was just a, o almost overwhelming just how much, you know, um, Christ she had in her life. Like in that instance, it was like, Megan is who I aspire to be, you know, and how I aspire to live my life with God. What was really cool about our friendship is that no matter how distant we kind of became, you know, how many classes we didn't have together and everything, she still made the effort to say, hey, Hadley, I haven't hung out with you in a while. You want to come over after school? Or, hey, Hadley, I think we have lunch together this trimester. Do you want to sit together? Just her constant presence in my life and obviously influence because friends have a lot of influence on your life is just was just really powerful. Christianity doesn't have to be by the books, I guess, that you don't have to be a, you know, go to church every day after school and, you know, it was just, it's just living how Jesus would have lived in this day and age and how, you know, not to exclude someone because they're not Christian, but to bring them in with open arms and kind of just become friends with everyone and live your life like Jesus instead of like, being like, oh, here's the Bible, read it, you know. Being a Christian isn't going to church, it's living like Jesus. She, there was definitely something different about her that kind of set her apart from everyone else. And then you look into it and, it, and it's God's influence. Jesus is working in her life. It just made me think, hey, I wanna try and do that. I wanna try and be like her and have that kind of relationship with God.